Okay guys, here's another orchid for you today. Uh, this one is Selogeny bufordiensi, and I hope I said that right. It's a uh, hybrid between Selogeny pandorata and Selogeny aspirata. Uh, it combines a, a couple of nice features of both parents. Uh, you Obviously you get the beautiful green color uh, with the black markings of the pandorata. One of the nice things is that on the lip of this, you get some really nice color from the Asperata parent. You get the brown warts on the lip. Uh, Pandorata is usually white at those crests and keels there on the lips. Uh, it's also nice because adding in the Asperata as a parent kind of tames down the size of the plant. Uh, Selogeny Pandorata can get really big and just ramble all over the place. You can see here the pseudobulbs are, are fairly close together and uh, it gets that from the Asperata parent. It's a really nice plant. The flowers smell good. They smell kind of like honey. Uh, some people say they have a, a citrus smell. I, I kind of think they smell like honey. They're beautiful flowers. Uh, you may not be able to see this, I'm not sure, um, with the camera, but the flowers have a really pretty sparkle on them, like satin uh, in the sunlight, which is really nice. It's a really pretty, pretty feature. A lot of orchid flowers have this, but is really striking against the, uh, the green color of the flower. So I hope you guys enjoy this one. This is uh, three spikes for me on this one this year. Um, that spike was the first one and then I got this one and this one which would have had 12 flowers on it but the end got broken. Uh, it was real windy here about a week ago and just as it was coming out the end of it got snapped off unfortunately otherwise this would have been a really nice bloom on this plant. But Three nice new growths on it and uh, three blooming leads this year maybe even more next year enjoy